This is a demonstration of the editing features of OrganAssist 3.1. The first thing I'm going to do is import a MIDI file that I recorded using Hauptwerk's built-in recorder actually on a different computer. And if we take a look at this, you can see that it was a, a longer recording session and that I played three different pieces. The first using the solo and the choir and subsequently the great. It's a standard piano roll interface. Registration is shown at the top and the expression settings. The first thing I'm going to do is to import it again and you can see that Organist offers you the chance to automatically divide it into individual tracks. It then prompts to ask how many seconds of silence you would like before the first note and after the last note of the piece. So now it has created three files and if we edit the first one we can see that there's just one second of silence all the registration is there, the expression settings, and if I press play, the piano roll interface is fairly standard. You can just drag and create a note on any keyboard you prefer. You can move a stop change somewhere else. You can add stop changes. And with Organ Assist, you can double click anywhere to restart a piece or start a piece at any point. So if I start here, you can see the clarinet and flute are included. I could decide to delete that. I can also change the expression settings, the volume. So for the solo, I, it's a maximum, I could bring it down. You can see that change has taken place. There is a second way of editing registration and expression, which is to start playing and then you can just and I could move, let's say, and then when you press stop, you can see all the new stop changes I put in and the change to the expression pedal. If I look at the third piece, you can see that there are many stop changes because I open slowly the crescendo pedal on the Hereford as I was recording it. An organist understands this and records them as individual stop changes displayed here. And so therefore, if I start the piece near the beginning, or if I start the piece near the end. Another feature, returning to the first of the tracks, is that you can mute certain divisions during playback. So for instance, I could mute the top line. So we only hear the accompaniment and the pedals or possibly just the, the, the tune and the pedals. Also, you can solo or listen to only one line, just the pedal, just the tune. So Organ Assist provides very easy editing, including if you wanted to change some notes, I could swap the notes that are on the uh, solo and on the choir, they're now the other way round. Or I can take all notes from the choir and move them onto the grate, etc. etc. Never do you have to know the MIDI channels or the MIDI messages that are involved. Organ Assist hides all that from you, you just edit. The other advantage of Organ Assist over many MIDI editors is that you can play the same pieces back completely unedited on another instrument, 
including instruments with less keyboards. And so if I go to St Anne's Mosley, I can take the piece that was recorded on the Hereford using the solo and the choir and I just press play. Not only does organ assist support many Hauptwerk instruments, it also supports most digital manufacturers including some of those with difficult MIDI implementations like Rogers where when you change a stop the message contains the information for every single stop that is on on the organ. So if I replay the first one when I switch on the first stop it actually switches the other stops off. But Organ Assist hides all this from you. You can edit and play back on Rogers. You can also edit and play back on some of the control systems for pipe organs. For instance, Peterson, which also has a very interesting MIDI implementation where each stop or a group of stops are included in a message. And then if you uh, change a lot of stops, it adds those messages together into one longer message. Again, you don't need to think about any of this. I should emphasize that whilst there is a lot that you can do editing within Organ Assist, you can also select the instrument that you are using and then from the library you can export any of the pieces as MIDI for the current organ. And if you do that, then the MIDI file that is created can be played back using any standard MIDI playback software including the internal MIDI player in Hauptwerk. I continue to maintain Organ Assist as a hobby. It's freely available for anyone to use and if anyone finds a MIDI implementation that it cannot cope with please contact me. I'm more than happy to add support for additional manufacturers.